fam? Welcome to episode 16. As you guys can hear, my voice is uh, going all over the place because we have an empty room here. We're just about done with this room, which means we're gonna be able to expand here. And that means we can help more people, means we can hire more people, we can continue to expand. We've had another busy month. It's been so great to see our growth throughout the last couple of years and just steadily seeing that grow. And as we get more and more into the busy season, we're not really seeing too much of a slow town time which means we're continually staying busy because we're adding new products, we're adding new software and implementing more and more things. The new things we've been fixing, we're really going deep into Apple repair watches. So if you know anyone, let them know that we're repairing Apple with the devices. Apple watches, we're repairing portable speakers, home speakers, we're also repairing headphones as usual. One of the things we've been focusing on this month in particular is continuing to grow our customer service. Customer service is so important to us. It's really the pillar of our business and it's where our foundation starts. So really making sure that every single person that interacts with the customer understands our values, our principles, what we stand for, what we believe in, making sure that our customer service is world renowned. That's a huge focus for us. So making sure that we educate our people as much as possible, making sure that they know what we believe is being shown and executed on all our platforms, through emails, through phone calls, through texts, whatever it is. We wanna make sure that that's clear, that we love our customers, and because of that, we're gonna give you our full attention and serve you because that's what we're here for. Summer's a great time because in the summer, the sun's out, so you're always excited to start. The day start earlier, and that's always a blast. What's really fun for us this year now is we actually have AC. I know that's uh, it's a big deal for us because last year we were struggling to make it through the summer, so we're just super excited that we can actually stay in the building, continue to work while the AC's pumping the air in. So. Summer is going to be great for us because we're going to be able to start our days earlier and really enjoy the days. And then once we're done with the work, you know, have some company picnics or anything like that. That's really fun for us where we can work inside of work, outside of work, we can hang out and still continue to build our relationships with our team. We hired more people. Eddie with Joe's Gaming Electronics. I used to work at my own little company where I'd repair electronics. I like to call it Eddie's Gaming Electronics just to mess with people. Um, but I came into work because I wanted a steady income because uh, I kept every time I got money put it back in the business so I want a little cash for myself. My name is Sasha Katuba. Uh, I work at Joe's and what I do is shipping and cleaning. I worked, well, I did construction so that was something else. Uh, I chose to work here because I wanted to learn how, how it's like to work with the team. Hi, Sergey Protaz here with Joe's Department Games Electronics. Uh, my name is Serge. My position is shipping. Well, I worked at YVR International Airport as an electrician and then I did some excavating for my father-in-law. I don't know, it's a great opportunity, something new, different career, change it up a bit, try it out and see where it goes and where I go in life. What do you like about Joe's? The fact that there's AC here and it's chill environment, everyone works together like a team and it's awesome. Nothing new here, we're continually hire more and more people and we're just, we're continuing to grow. We're almost done with the renovation here, we got the walls done, we got electrical done, we're gonna have the floors up here real quick and then we'll be moving people in here probably within the next week, which is exciting. We've been meaning to do this for the last six months and slowly taking little steps to get that along. But we're at a point now where we're kind of maximum capacity of our last area. This is our area over here where we've done a lot of the different work and now we're just getting to this area which is gonna allow us to have even more people here to make sure we can serve people's needs better. That's important to us. And we're just, it's such a great thing. Remodeling sucks, there's nothing fun about it but being able to breathe life back into something, like this building, this floor, this floor looks like crap right now, but we're gonna do, we're gonna sand it, we're gonna paint it, and breathe life back into it, make it look beautiful. And that's what's cool about remodeling. We're gonna turn this into a functional part of our business. It's gonna be excellent, we're gonna love it, and everyone's excited about having a little bit more room, a little more breathing room here, and that's gonna allow us to just help more people, have more products, repair more things, and eventually continue to grow our team further and further as we have an ambition to do so. Our focus is to make sure that we grow personally, professionally, and spiritually. We set goals with ourselves, with our team, making sure that we know, hey, these are the goals we're setting for ourselves and our business, and we're gonna grow together and keep each other accountable. One of the ways that we keep each other accountable is by having monthly goal meetings. That's something that we implemented this year. I love it because we have meetings every single month on a yearly goal. We can adjust and modify things, but 
it's great to have that peer pressure, a little peer pressure also, you have that kind of ability from your coworkers and your peers to allow you to make sure you achieve this goal and if you don't, someone's gonna be on your ass about it. We are a company with Christian beliefs and we really focus on helping others and making sure that we can incorporate our religion and our faith with our business and making sure that we can actually have goals and with our spiritual goals it allows us to kind of just put everything encompass it into one thing. All right, folks, hope you guys enjoyed episode 16. We're trying to roll these out as soon as possible. There's a lot of different things going on here, so we're just trying to cram a couple minutes in the middle of the day. So hope you guys enjoyed this. Share this video, like it, do whatever you can. If you see a company that's growing as well or people who are ambitious and need a little bit of motivation, on, hey, you can do it here, feel free to share this video. You know, we're a small company, but we're growing. Started in my bedroom, and now we have this facility and so many people here doing this and following the Joshi E way. We, we do this video just to document what we're doing, but also just to motivate others to know that, hey, there's a lot of opportunity out there and you gotta take it and make it yours. Have a good one.